This is the first fish of the evening, <clears throat> little dates. I had some amazing roach sport here the other day. The river was carrying another, it's carrying probably a foot now, but it was carrying another, probably about another six inches on top of this. And I had four roach between a pound and a half and a pound 14. It was really good fishing. It was hard work because it was trotting and the river was flowing really quick. But I was getting bites right there. Oh, shit, that was a decent fish. Bollocks. Bollocks, that got a bit of roach. Not going to get many chances. Shit. Oh, so yeah, it's hard to hit the bites because the because you're trotting towards you. But I'm just going to loose feed like mad. That was a decent fish, that one I just lost. Hoping it was a chub. There's quite a few chub in here. That was a really good bite. You don't get many bites up the top there. The little ones. The little ones tend to sit down the bottom. But like I say, it's hard work. You've only got a short trot and you've got to keep it tight. <sighs> Mind you, I have just deepened off a bit. Might be dragging on the bottom. I don't think it is. I was getting the bites just down there last time. It was quite cool. <laughs> I'll take that. Nice perch. Good work, mate. Oh, I'm making, making a drama of this. Okay. Might go half a pound. Lovely. People sometimes get confused by what I mean when I'm feeding hard. I don't always mean I'm going to feed a lot in one go. I'll feed a lot as in more regularly. So I will quite happily cast, feed twice in a cast and 20 maggots each time and make sure every cast there's some bait going down, continually bait going down. If you can get it to go down with your float, even better. Quite hard to achieve. Oh, <laughs> struck a bit too hard then. Oh, that's a good cast. Oh yeah, that's right in where they are. Oh, no. I think that was the bottom. There's a fish. And it's a roach, I think it's a roach. Actually, I think it's a chub. It's a little chub. I just missed a bite because I was, uh, hadn't reeled up the line tight enough. So I had to reel and strike at the same time. <laughs> it's only a little chub, this one. A puppy job. Could do the roach about that size. It's alright though. Nice fish. Probably a pound and a half.
There's another one. This is a roach. Oh yeah, it's a lovely roach. Come on, mate. Just behave. They're not as uncivilized as Chub, but they go for it. Steady. Look at that. What an absolute beauty. <laughs> Look at that. I think that might be the one I caught the other day out of here. Had a bit of a mangled mouth. I think that weighed one pound six or one pound eight. No, it was one pound eight. Beautiful old battle scarred roach. Yeah, you've got to feed hard and you've got to feed constantly. Right, it's no good just chucking in a handful of maggots every now and then. You've got to be like constant every single run down, you've got to be putting some maggots through. Even twice a cast, three times a cast in various spots along your run. Keep that line tight. Oh, I can see a few fish flashing at those maggots now. There's constantly maggots in the water going past them. They just get into a reckless abandonment of fear and just oh, 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 and want to eat everything, especially chub. Chub are really greedy. Sometimes with chub, you have to feed more to get them to feed. There's another one. I'm guessing this is a chub. Ugh, come off. Had to be a chub. Way that went. Ugh. I went down to a smaller hook and uh, just attempted to bite and it snapped me off. That's annoying. I went down from a 15 to a 12 thinking, oh, that'd be right. Go back up. One of those things I'm not too bothered about losing and getting snapped off by the chub because um, the chub I'm not going to get snapped off by the roach on that tackle and the chub if they get pissed off and spook off it makes it easier to catch the roach because it's only roach left in there so I might go back down again see what happens I'm somewhere in the middle of what I was before I'm losing the light a bit, that's going to be the next problem. <clears throat> the other thing that's happening is uh, as I'm reeling in to take up the slack, I'm sure it's pulling the float through faster. So I can't quite suss how to avoid that. I'm sort of trying hard not to reel the float in, but it's definitely, oh, definitely leaning a bit. Trying to follow the rod tip. Follow it with the rod tip more than anything. See like there, there's a bow in the line and that float flew through then. Definitely quite an art upstream trotting. What's this? This feels heavy. Ooh. Ooh. It's quite a bit of flow on. Uh, uh. Ooh. I was just going to say the roach, but after that, that little one, maybe it's a jab. No, I think it is. Oh, it is a jab. Not very big chub.
hoping there was another big roach. It's too chubby bad like that. Let's get him back. It's an unusual cast, I haven't cast over there before. More by mistake than purpose. You never know, sometimes that results in a bite. Just putting it somewhere different. There's one. Just trying to get them a bit further out of the. Oh, don't do that. I think this is another roach. It is a roach. Oh. I was just trying to get them a bit further out from the edge because, weirdly enough, oh, that's a beautiful roach. Look at that. Oh my days. Wow. Look at that roach. Wowzers. It's a freaking donkey roach. Oh my god. Did you see that? I can't believe how beautiful that thing is. Wow. That might go two pounds, you know. <laughs> it's a big fish. Right, I'm sorry these are such grainy pictures, but that one is. One pound six, and that one was two pound twelve with the net. I've got to weigh the net, and we'll see what it weighs. Get this one back. Well, <laughs> I hate to do this, but apologies once again. I did a terrible ending after that. Uh, catching that brace of roach, they were beautiful roach, really nice. Stood there all like this in front of the camera, lovely jubbly, blah 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 blah. Pull big refish and all that old crap. <laughs> And, uh, beep, 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 beep. Run out of battery. It was my last battery. I managed to make three videos that day on three batteries. Uh, I've now bought two more. Apologies for waffling on. Thank you for watching the video. Roach diaries, big roach diaries, fishing fever. I've really enjoyed catching the roach. I haven't been able to get back to them because the river's been flooded. Uh, it carries a flood water very well, that river, but it's been horrible. <laughs> I keep meaning to go, but it's like, oh, look out the window. It looks horrible. Anyway, uh, I will have another go, but 115, that's what that roach weighed. I took the net off, which was, was it 10 ounces or 12 ounces? Uh, yeah, 115, that's four 115 roach I've caught. I um, ugh, Two from a river and uh, two from a lake. But yeah, one day, one day I might be blessed. But anyway, hope you enjoyed the video. I'll see you next time.